Trust Bank. Building communities built on trust. The Kelly Clarkson Show, weekdays at 2 on LEX 18. Good morning. It's Monday. Our top story, concern for the safety of law enforcement. Yeah, it's all in the wake of that Mar-a-Lago search one week ago. It's August 15th. This is today. Under fire this morning, the unprecedented levels of threats against federal agents. Some warned even their families could be at risk. This kind of rhetoric is very dangerous to our country. Security ramped up at federal buildings from coast to coast. And at Mar-a-Lago, the top secret documents seized and the lawmakers on both sides now demanding to know why they were there. On the mend, famed author Salman Rushdie taken off a ventilator and talking this morning, three days after being brutally attacked on stage. What his son is saying about his road to recovery and what we're learning about his attacker straight ahead. Remembering Anne Haish touching new tributes after she was removed from life support overnight. Afghanistan, one year later, our eye-opening look at life there under Taliban rule after the last American troops left and the major questions this morning about U.S. security just ahead. All that plus taking off the dramatic rise in travel insurance sales and claims during a summer of airline chaos. So is it worth it? And all not in a day's work, the new office movement that finds employees, many of them younger, saying no to the hustle and bustle. Not doing the job with two to three people, you know, stuff like that. Yeah, that's a recipe for disaster. I'm going to tell you that. Inside the polarizing trend of quiet quitting. Today, Monday, August 15th, 2022. From NBC News, this is Today with Savannah Guthrie and Oda Cutby, live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. Hi, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to Today. It is Monday morning. Glad you're with us. Really glad you are with us. We missed you. Did you have a good week off? I had a great birthday week, but I'm happy to be sitting next to you this morning. We have another busy news week. Yeah, we've got a lot to talk about. We're going to start with that new warning issued mm -hmm. by the FBI and Department of Homeland Security saying threats to federal law enforcement have spiked since agents seized those classified documents from Donald Trump's Florida resort. Yeah, the FBI is warning the threats are occurring mostly online and that personal information of Possible targets is being revealed, including the home addresses of agents, even the identities of family members. Well, this is coming amid a new bipartisan push to see just what was in those documents, where the investigation goes from here, and what was the threat to national mm -hmm. security, if any. For the very latest, let's go to NBC senior Washington correspondent Hallie Jackson on the story for us. Hi, Hallie. Good morning. Hi, good morning, Hoda.